Hello, my YouTube friends. How are we doing today? I'm doing much better today than I was yesterday, that is for sure. Um, so let's address that a little bit. Uh, we did not get a vlog up yesterday, and when it comes down to it, I just really needed a break from YouTube. I needed a day for myself with the cameras off. Um, I was dealing with some things mentally and physically that I was just like, I, I can't handle life right now. I need to take a break. And I really didn't want to post something that was going to be mostly negative. I just, I will always want to be true to myself. That is something that I pride myself on with our YouTube videos is that we're always true to ourselves. We're never be, trying to be somebody that we're not. We're always being true to who we are. And I didn't want to turn on the camera and pretend to be happy because yesterday was not a very happy, uplifting day for me. Um, if you guys watched the previous vlog, our, our last vlog, you would know that I wasn't feeling well. I was just dealing with just, I don't know, I, you know, I had started my period and so that probably had to do with a lot of it. But I, I also just was not feeling well. I wasn't feeling myself. I was dealing with a little bit of depression issues and I just... Yesterday, I just really needed a day for myself to take a break and work through some things, both physically and mentally, and it was just a breaking point kind of day for me. I commend those people who do the daily vlogging thing and are true to themselves. I don't know how many how many are 100% because I just couldn't do it. I just, I don't think I could do seven days a week daily vlogging and somehow still be true to myself and put out positive, uplifting videos every single day because not every single day is positive and uplifting. So um, I just thought I would share that with you guys. For those of you who have just stuck through our channel and have just been so supportive, we've recently got a lot of people who, you know, watch our videos and look forward to our vid videos every single day. For those of you who do that and are so supportive of us, I love you truly with all of my heart because it means so much. And I am very sorry for those of you that were looking forward to watching one of our videos yesterday and we didn't have one. Like I said, I just, I needed a break for myself. And YouTube is a hobby. This isn't a job for Doug and I. This isn't something that should engulf our whole life. It is something that we do as a hobby. It is something that we do for fun. It is something that we do to document our life and have for our future to look back on. And it's also something that uh, we're passionate about. We're passionate about sharing things that we are interested in with you guys. And so for that being said, this isn't a job. This isn't something that I feel like it is an obligation for us to do. It isn't something that I ever want to feel obligated to do. I want to do it because I want to do it, if that makes sense. And so for those reasons, sometimes you need to step away. You need to take a break. And yesterday was one of those days that I just, I really needed the cameras off and just time for myself. Um, I hope those of you who were looking forward to yesterday's video understand, or just those of you watching now, understand where I'm coming from. Um, and in the future, if there are days where I just need to take a break and we don't have a vlog up, I hope you'll understand that too. So Doug made us some soup last night. I'm just having leftover soup for lunch today. Um, we don't have any juice currently, otherwise I would be having juice for lunch, but I took out leftovers from last week of different vegetables. We have cucumber, celery, um, we have a, th a head of spinach left, and then we also have a honeydew melon that I'm going to juice up after this just so we have some juice for the rest of the day. Mom and I have to go grocery shopping because we failed to go yesterday. Um, I wasn't feeling well and I don't think she was, she was feeling too good yesterday either. She had some really bad allergic reactions, so we're going to be going today. And I think after I'm done eating this soup, I'm going to head over and make a juice for all of us. So we have at least something today. I wanted to show you guys though, um, I got these a couple weeks ago, uh, like last week. And they're like cute little placemats. This one is made of bamboo. And I've been using them for taking my Instagram pictures of like the food that I make. And I've been getting really good responses on Instagram. People seem to really like them. A lot of people have said that some of my pictures look very like high quality, high end. So I'm kind of excited about it. It's days like today when when I work I have such a very bad day. That makes me glad I, I have an interview for CBS 
tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock. And I'm very grateful that I have that interview, possible going into my career type choice. Because, I don't know, like, the more I work the now, like, the more it becomes evident that I need to leave. Because it's not going to be enough to feed my family. It's not going to be enough to f put food on the table. It's not going to be enough to pay the bills. Because I get days like today where I make $7. Really? That's not going to pay for a night out, let alone a bill. A $25 minimum payment. So, it's just one of those days that I'm just kind of bummed, but I'm glad that I have an interview tomorrow so I can possibly try and get something better for my life. Move into something that's going to really help me as opposed to you know just hinder and hurt me so I don't know I, I'm I'm rambling I know but I'm just grateful for an opportunity to get a job at CVS and I'm praying that I get the opportunity to work there so if you guys could pray for me wish me luck whatever I have an interview tomorrow for the actual location that I'm going to be working at so if you can please pray for me, wish me luck, I'd be grateful. Honey crisp apples. Those look really yep. good. I've never had them. Have we, have, you ever, have we ever bought them before? Yeah, but we didn't share. Like with a you. long time ago. Me and Dad. If we didn't share with you guys. Rude. <laughs> so we're here at Sprouts. I'm gonna get our fruit and veggies and get some stuff to make dinner tonight. I'm gonna be making veggie burgers with quinoa and some other good stuff, and then um, some uh, cauliflower tots, some cauliflower tater tots. So I think dinner's gonna be really, really good. Ha! Another one of my favorite jars that I like to drink out of. Another one just broke. Dust. Another one bites the dust. And another one gone. And another one gone. Oh, that's loud. But it also cut my foot. I don't know if you guys can see that. It fell on my foot, and that hurts a lot. Feels like um, kind of feels like a paper cut. But I'm about to go get my shoes on, so I can cook dinner. My hair is wet because I came home and took a shower. I just felt disgusting. I felt like really gross. Even though I showered this morning, I just felt really gross and decided I'm going to take another shower. But I'm really sad that, that that glass jar is gone. Really sad. It's one of my faves. This is what we're eating for dinner. That's what you're eating anyway. That's what I'm, I'm eating, yeah. <laughs> You got some I had the same thing, but mushrooms and onions, sauteed mushrooms and onions, on uh, the side. On the side, okay. So we got a veggie burger, we got cauliflower tots, and, and some onions. Sauteed onions. Yeah. Yeah. Is it good? It, yeah, actually, She's it's really good. It's really good. It's very brown. It's very brown, but I posted a picture on Instagram and I was like, this is how you properly trick your man into eating vegetables. <laughs> My dad ate it, and he liked it, so. Doug, let's play a game. What? Let's play Guess What's in the Quinoa Burgers. You already know they're quinoa, so. Quinoa. Okay. Well, I see orange, so I guess there's some carrots. Correct. I saw green, which could mean there's a number of different things, like spinach or... Mom, don't say anything, because I think she knows. Or lettuce or... I would not put lettuce in that. Lettuce would not work. Spinach might work, but that's not what it is. Keep guessing. Eh, guess again. <laughs> it's not kale. 
No, because we don't do kale here. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, could be mint, could be cilantro, could be... Close. Parsley. There you go. <laughs> okay, dudes, I think we're going to call it a night, and we'll see you guys on Monday. I might end up recording a video tomorrow for Saturday. Not 100% sure, just because you guys know I haven't been completely myself lately. Um, we figured out that I might actually have a UTI based on it hurts when I pee, and... Um, I've just been really not all there the last few days, and that's another kind of symptom of it. So, if I'm not feeling good by Monday, I'm going to go to the doctor, get some antibiotics. I can't say that word without <laughs> pronunciating my words. Antibiotics. And hopefully... Antibiotics? Antibiotics. Antibiotics. Antibiotics? Yeah. And hopefully, I will be able to get over whatever's going on with me. But thanks guys for watching. Thanks for being understanding about me needing a break sometimes. Love you guys. See you tomorrow. See you Monday. 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 We'll see you Monday.